Hey guys, how are you? I hope that you're having a fantastic weekend. Today, instead of doing a time-lapse video, I thought it would be really nice to uh, show you guys how I tear my paper to get a deckled edge. So basically it's just a decorative edge that um, results from when you tear the paper instead of cut it with scissors. So I've been getting some DMs about it and um, I thought it would just be nice to share how I do this. Um, so I'm going to show you right now on some generic watercolor paper. What I use is a ruler and a pencil. So you could use a book instead of a ruler but I do highly suggest using a ruler because you can measure. So I would also suggest choosing a paper that's larger than the size that you want to end up with. So this here is a five and a half by five and a half what we're working with is a, I think it's a 9 by 12. A 9 by 12, let me just double check that. Yep, 9 by 12. Yeah, I could get two of these. So what I'm going to do first is measure my paper out and make some marks where I want to tear it. So if I want five and a half, I can fit two of them this way. Eleven inches, and in the middle, we're going to make another mark at the six inch, and that leaves us with a five and a half by a five and a half. So we're going to do the same thing on the bottom. Now, what I'm going to do is line up my ruler onto the marks that I made. And I'm going to hold the ruler down with one hand and I'm going to hold it pretty firmly. It really helps if your ruler has a non-slip bottom or this one has cork on the bottom so it's helpful to keep it put so it doesn't move. And then I'm going to take the top corner of my paper and I'm going to hold this firmly and I'm going to hold this down firmly where my hand is holding the ruler so it doesn't slip and I'm going to tear towards me somewhat slowly. Okay, so then this paper is a little hard. The harder your paper, um, the more careful I think you might want to be, just from my experience. I'll zoom in one more time for you guys um, so you can see this here, this decorative edge that you get from tearing the paper. That's what I am trying to achieve. So I do the same thing again. I measure We'll do, you know, I'll show you the short edge. Typically I would just put my ruler over the short edge and tear from the long side, but I'll show you what it looks like if you were to do it this way. Um, it'll be a little slower and harder to tear. I'm going to hold down the ruler really firmly and we're going to tear from this corner. But see how it's a little bit more inconvenient? Alrighty, and there we go. So now both sides of the paper are deckled. And if you feel like it's too much, you can always go back in and just like tear it a little bit more. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is since I want five and a half by five and a half, we've got five and a half this way, so now we wanna do it this way. We're gonna take some off of this side and some off of this side. So I'm going to take an inch off of this side, and then we want one, two, three, four, five and a half. Make the same marks on the other side, one inch, six and a half, and then we're going to tear. Held down firmly, take it from the top corner, and tear towards you. There we go. We're going to line up the ruler onto our marks, take it from the top corner, and tear towards you. And there you go. That is a five and a half by five and a half deckled edge piece of paper. And that's how I do it. I hope that you guys found it helpful. I was really happy to share this with you. I hope you enjoyed the video this week and I will see you next week for another one. Thanks guys.